that you're here, you're without an income, and you've got children, and these children are just beginning out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, the, the, the school journey yeah, yeah. is too long, there are medical bills to think about. So, so that for me, I would say it's, it was a perfect, it was, it, it was just what the doctor ordered. Let me, exactly, to, yeah. so, yeah, so you just found something that was picking yeah, yeah. to the space that I was in at that point in yeah, time. Yeah. Of course, the, the aspiration looks daunting. I mean, looked daunting, and I mean, how am I ever going to get there? Get there. But I just said, you know, a day at a time, whatever yeah, little you small. get, you start small, yeah. and then uh, yeah. and, and and build it over time, yeah. and it's been exciting. Yeah. It's been exciting to find that one shilling becoming a shilling and a fifty cents and two shillings. Yes. And yeah. Yeah. Yes. 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 Thank you for those of you who have been following us on this amazing conversation with Catherine Wahome, uh, an amazing guest. Uh, we have, this is the third episode, and the first episode we just listened to her story. The second episode she told uh, us how she got into retirement and we redefined what is retirement. And this, this particular episode we want to talk about her journey with Nabo Capital. Uh, just when she had retired, she began a journey with Nabo Capital. Mm. So, Catherine, first and foremost, mm. I'm really thankful that you are one of our clients and we really, really value your presence as one of our clients. We look up to you as a friend and as a client. Mm -hmm. um, how has that journey been? The journey has been excellent and, I, and I'm not just saying this because it's on, yeah, it's, on it's, it's the reality. Yeah. But Maybe what triggered you to start Did you just read my mind? Capital? I was actually just going to seek your permission <laughs> to, to take a step back. And uh, My coming to, to Nabo Capital was actually triggered by not very good events. Yes. As exciting as the space I was can be, it can also be very tricky because yeah. you're dependent on uh, clients. Yeah. So 2016, 2017 was not a good time at all, business-wise. Yeah. Business-wise, yes. Actually, see, if I was a business, I would have been shut down because things were really bad. It was around the time running to elections. Uh, running to elections, yes, in 2017. So it was a very dry, dry spell. Mm. And I remember even trying to figure out, so what should I do? It's about the same time as you would know that I lost my husband as well. Yeah, yeah. So those were huge shocks. shocks. Yeah. Um, I should have said as part of introducing myself that I'm a mother of three young men, yeah. 24, 22 and 16. Mother of boys. Mother of boys, yeah. yes. So here I am, no work, no spouse. Three young men. Three young men. To looking take, at their mother. Looking at their mother yeah. now. And um, so I had to think and think really hard. And to be very honest, for me, this is another God moment. And I think I shared that story with you when, I, when we had that, when I called. And I just thought, so what do I want to do? I tried my hand in real estate. I tried you know, a few properties. You have to. If side you're, hustles. Side hustles. If you're Kenyan, sure, you must have a plot there. So there was a plot here and there. But I just thought to myself, this land thing was becoming too much. I'm not managing and stuff. And I remember we had had a conversation with you and we talked about investment. But then it sounded very, in, you know, the places you sit and you say, you keep going. But I, I would just be polite enough and listen. But that's not mm. my thing. I didn't know you were just polite to <laughs> <laughs> So as, as I was just reflecting one evening and, uh, you know, those aha moments, you know, and I just knew empires came and I, and, and I shared with you how that happened. And I made a call. Mm. And then we had our 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 session and we went through it and what the product was and so on and introduced me to a young man pleasant young man called jeremy and that's where the journey began yeah. and and jeremy was very very in a very subtle way but uh, he kept saying you know if you want this thing to be meaningful there are targets mm -hmm. that must you know if your money is this much this is so much that mm -hmm. we can do with it as it grows and so on and so he actually put that seed in me mm. to grow. Mm. Because then he painted a, a wonderful picture of if you get here. You, give, you, you came up with an aspiration. We came up, aspiration mm. is aspiration, the word, yeah. Yes. 
so so my work was now to you know work towards work towards, the aspiration work towards in that, partnership with nabo in partnership with nabo and um it's been a wonderful journey to be very honest because then now I, I don't have to worry the headache of is my portfolio performing is it not performing yeah, yeah. I don't have to be glued to the TV screen checking mm. how shares Market are doing prices. you know <laughs> I mean it's it's I told you I dropped accounting yeah, so yeah. that's not that's not my strong area so it's been a real real yeah. relief yeah. Um, the timeliness of the reports mm. the politeness of the people and you yeah. see investment is 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 jargon yeah, and it's is is a field a lot of us are not familiar with yeah. but what I found with the Nabo team is the patience mm. to actually walk Yeah. the journey with you yeah. and even pretty obvious questions you yeah. know why is this decimal point here not here yeah. you know with with yeah so it's been a pleasant journey yeah. for me perhaps the the real game changer has been the target setting the target which which brings me to where we began yes. this conversation mm. i remember as me introducing you to what we believe in it's like our, our philosophy in mm. nabo yeah. invest with purpose invest with purpose mm. people don't just should not just invest people should invest to get to a particular aspiration mm. and uh, i wanted you just to backtrack a little bit how did that did your retirement decision which was not very well planned <laughs> and this uh, and now of 15 how mm-hmm. did it fit in It's, it's actually interesting you raised that because <laughs> when I sat with you yeah. and then you sent Jeremy to me and he came with this very elaborate plan investment plan at some point I thought okay this is too complex for me but like you think the aspiration was very very clear very clear and very exciting mm. and for me the way it fitted in is you see I'm finding myself now in a bit of a tight spot yeah. because now you're out of work technically and you're the breadwinner and you're the breadwinner mm-hmm. and these bills are here are still coming are still coming and i know at the back of my mind somewhere i kept asking myself what if what if i was out of a job what would happen but you see you don't give it serious thought yeah. until it actually Happen. happens so finding myself now in a situation where somebody is at least giving you a road map yeah. of how now you can get how you can answer that what if yes. meaningfully yes. certain very well And, and also just like I've said because the trigger for me was now that care mm. that you're here you're without an income mm. and you've got children and these mm. children are just beginning out yeah, yeah, yeah. you know the, the, the school journey yeah, yeah. is too long there are medical bills to think about mm. so, so that for me I would say it, it was a perfect it was it, it was just what the doctor ordered let me exactly yeah. yes, so, so you just found something that was picking yeah, yeah. to the space that I was in at that point in yeah, time yeah. Of course the the aspiration looks daunting I mean looked daunting and I mean how am I ever going to get there to get there but I just said you know a day at a time whatever little start you small. get you start small yeah. and then uh, yeah. and, and and build it over time yeah. and it's been exciting yeah. it's been exciting to find that one shilling becoming a shilling and a 50 cents and two shillings yes. and yeah. Yeah. yes yes mm. yes and for me that is very fulfilling and listening to you it's like every every piece of the puzzle for you tends to fall in place in a very timely fashion because here you are you've retired you've experienced turbulence of business a unfortunate event of you know the disappearance of your husband and then you you have all these responsibilities and then here pious presents and investing mm-hmm. with purpose mm-hmm. idea and uh, and you begin Uh, I think that's like a a path being at the right place at the right time. I want to throw even another piece <laughs> in the puzzle because then in that mix uh, then I get a job with government. And then you get a job with government. <laughs> you know, uh, yet another adventure for me because I'm thinking let me go to this place that I've never been. Yeah. I mean, and it's been an exciting journey still is. So now at least with the job now you've got some regular yeah flow of income yeah. that now you can be yeah. consistent with yeah. yes yeah so god just has a way of just uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Fixing, bringing my fixing stuff the puzzles together just fixing it for me yeah yes yeah. Yes, mm. yes yes so that's that 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 to me is uh, is is very interesting so you began the journey with enable yeah. 
and you be- had very humble beginnings. Completely, completely. Yes. In fact, I kept wondering which of your books my name is on because you know <laughs> there are tears. Yes. Are tears. Eh? <laughs> yeah, I kept like I'm just you know borderline client who any day can be thrown out. Yes, yes, <laughs> yeah, yes, yes, yeah. yes. yes. Mm. Well, a very interesting perception that uh, we always have uh, mm. to fight out there that we are meant for the for the high end. Exactly. Yeah. Uh, mm. But we say that we are open to everyone mm. and uh, what for us is to help you to figure out how do you start small mm. and how and do build, you yeah. uh, build towards your best that you can be mm. and, I'm, and, and I'm glad so um, have you met your aspirations and ha- what are some of the surprises that have, you've noticed in that journey with Nabo? Mm.